Kids TV, Germany's the good one. Kids TV says that Germany is the good one in Germany. The kids show seems to imply that we have to live with how killing Palestinians will likely continue, as if we had no part in the killing. This is a resigned emotional managing of how to bear seeing the images from the conflict. What children want is not fluff but facts, facts on how their own democracy would help de-escalate by ceasing to escalate. Lobo is loved by children because it has the potential to be honest without being distressing. We make Logo better by looking at its blind spots. Logo is leaving out that Germany provides the weapons. At least it did. Germany tries to help the people in Palestine, the Logo show claims. Logo pretends the reason for why it is difficult to deliver goods is simply the fighting. No mention of the humanitarian camouflage of hiding violence by pretending it is a humanitarian measure. Even if not self-censoring, German Kids TV is affected by the same blind spots as the rest of the establishment. German TV tells kids that Gazans are not really free, but there is no mention that Gazans are trapped, just that Israel controls Gaza's borders. Controlling borders sounds a lot different than the truth of trapping people and bombing them. If we tell kids that one side controls the movement of the other side, it's a very civil sounding word for stopping any movement and controlling everything. Instead of expulsion, German Kids TV says Israel simply won a war after its founding and that Palestinians declared the war in the first place. Is being genocidally expelled really the same as losing a war? German Kids TV never mentions Nakba, calling it a war makes it easy. We are dealing with a very, very complicated issue, says one interviewee in the show. The special kind of privilege of German TV bosses manages to not dehumanize Palestinians too directly. Logo says Hamas wants to destroy Israel, but doesn't add that many Gazans don't want to be ruled by Hamas. Logo does say Palestinians largely want peace like many Israelis. Pretending that this is a conflict over control over a territory makes it forgettable that Palestinians are not occupying Israeli territories. Palestinians are mostly asking to be not attacked relentlessly until they are all dead. Palestinians agreed on ceasefires that Israel says it also wants but doesn't sign. Pretending that it is simply two equals Fighting in a war over territory is wrong. The show does not go as far as implying we should simply side against Palestinians. The show, to its credit, does not make it look too much like it is simply too irreconcilable side, so it can only be solved if one side wins. But there is no mention that one side is doing most of the killing. There is no mention that one side is occupying the other for so long that it counts as a legal occupation that turned into permanent apartheid. No mention that only equal rights can bring peace when sharing territory. No mention that there's a huge demand for ceasefire worldwide. But Germany, of course, should aim to be a good helper. The first step is that Germany today announced it will arrest Netanyahu entering Germany if the application for his arrest warrant is becoming a warrant by ICC.